BaronsCatalog.com, the first name in quality. Royal Crown Derby China with dinnerware tableware, tea set china, Royal Crown figurines, and their collectible antique dinnerware all inherited the same fine quality and design that began over 250 years ago. Whether it's the Royal Crown Derby plate in the Royal Crown Derby Amari pattern or Royal Crown Derby paperweights, the variety of pieces with lavish designs are endless and the quality is always top notch. Isn't the selection of Royal Crown Derby China dinnerware tableware big enough for you to find just what you're looking for? Wouldn't a tea china set or royal crown figurines be a great gift for that deserving loved one? Isn't it a prerequisite when you're shopping for a fine bone china for it to be of top notch quality and design? The history of royal crown derby dinnerware began just before 1750 when the Huguenot, Andrew Planch, established the first china works in Derby. His exquisite porcelain figurines led to a fortuitous link with William Dewsbury who eventually became the guiding light in a very successful partnership manufacturing fine bone china of the highest quality. King George III recognized the uniqueness of royal crown porcelain in 1775 when he granted the factory the rare honor of being able to incorporate a crown into the backstamp. Much later in 1890, Queen Victoria also gave royal crown china her seal of approval not only by awarding the royal warrant but also by granting the title the Royal Crown Derby Porcelain Company. After his father's death in 1786, William Dewsbury II set about making the Derby China Works the finest in Europe. Great developments were made in body, glaze, potting, and decoration, and the factory benefited from what was probably the most talented group of ceramic artists ever assembled for Royal Crown Porcelain. A tremendous variety of objects, all lavishly decorated, has made the 1786 to 1795 decade one of the most desirable and interesting for collectors of antique dinnerware and porcelain figurines. Artistic talent included Borman, the watercolor landscape genius, Royal Crown figurines painters Askew and Banford, and the exceptional talents of flower painters Withers, Billingsley, and Pegg. Royal acclaim followed in 1890 when the company was appointed manufacturers of porcelain to Her Majesty. Royal Crown Derby China was acquired by S. Pearson & Son, the Pearson Family Company, to become part of their Allied English Potteries group. Brian Branscombe was appointed art director and established the new graphic and printing departments. Pearson subsequently bought Royal Dulton. The company was then merged into the larger group. The first Royal Crown Derby paperweights, Five Birds and a Rabbit, were launched at a reception at Chatsworth House. These models were to develop into one of the most important ranges of China porcelain figurines in the world of collecting. Hugh Gibson, a former director of Royal Dalton and member of the Pearson family, leads a buyout of Royal Crown Derby dinnerware. Once more, the firm becomes an independent and privately owned concern during the year in which it also celebrates 250 years of manufacture of porcelain in Derby. The Royal Crown Derby Paperweights range celebrates its 21st birthday with a special stopper for the year and a new collection of five birds and a rabbit. From the Royal Crown Derby plate in the Royal Crown Derby Amari pattern with the hundreds of other antique dinnerware patterns to Royal Crown figurines, tea set china, and the other countless quality driven Royal Crown china pieces your choice is an investment in fine dining for your special gatherings. Available today at barronscatalog.com.